UNESCO in South Sudan is working very closely with the government on its four areas of mandate, education, culture, science, and support to the media. FAO has been working in South Sudan for well over a decade, bringing our technical assistance in support of the resilience of livelihoods to promote the rural economy and to work for a hunger-free South Sudan. UNFPA will continue to support the government to reduce maternal mortality to ensure that no woman dies giving birth. Mine Action has cleared and released back to the general public an area of land in excess of the size of 156,000 football pitches. This has enabled agriculture to flourish, it's enabled schools to be built, hospitals and clinics to be developed, and this is as a result of hard work by the team. We strive to achieve five outcomes, democratic and responsive government, inclusive and sustainable growth, enhanced social services, improved our community security, and increased access to justice. UNICEF, as always, will strive to ensure that your voice is heard. We will stand by you as you grow as a nation in managing humanitarian priorities, and we will work with you in supporting the vulnerable people within the country. On this occasion, I would like to wish all South Sudanese a very happy second anniversary. Congratulations on your second anniversary of independence. UNFP congratulates the people and government of South Sudan in their second uh, independence anniversary. We wish everyone in South Sudan a safe and happy Independence Day. On behalf of the United Nations Development Program, congratulations on Independence Day. A special congratulations to all the children in South Sudan on the second anniversary of independence. The UN Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs in South Sudan congratulates the people of South Sudan in your second anniversary of independence. Celebrate. My